as the deputy party leader of ANC, the party that is ruling Western Province and the party that is going to rule this country, we've engaged the President of the Republic of Kenya on two issues. One, on debt restructuring. We are happy to announce that the President has restructured external debts with other uh, countries, but we are only remaining with China. So we are asking China to consider restructuring the debt uh, that Kenya owes them because of the uh, corona pandemic so that we can reactivate our economy. In that uh, uh, essence, we are also asking our neighbor, the Deputy President of the Republic of Kenya, stop your war with the President. The focus should be fighting corona and secondly, improving on the economy for the benefit of the local Mwanaichi. Wars will never take this country anywhere. As ANC, we have engaged the president. We had a meeting with him and we have had several meetings with him. The president is willing to support Honorable Musalia Mudavadi as a compromise candidate to become the sixth president of the fifth president of the Republic of Kenya. That one I can talk with authority. I've I've sat in that, those meetings. Uhuru has accepted to support Musalia and he has given Musalia conditions. Move across the country, gain support, then I'll support you. We are taking advantage of the war that Ruto is fighting the president to Pitya Katikati Pale, ill we can go to the state house. We are taking advantage of that war so that we can front Musalia to take that position that is vacant now because Uhuru needs advice on how to salvage the economy. Uhuru does not need wars. Uhuru needs advice on how the small disbursement on projects that can be realigned from bigger projects, we go to economy that is facing one, one inch. We are also negotiating with the Reila Amolo Dinga. We are asking in Baba, the only way for this economy to be revived, the only compromise candidate is Musalia Mudavadi. That is the only guy who can salvage this economy. And he has history. He salvaged this country when you are facing the, 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 the Golden Bug scandal. Musalia has been on the forefront of fighting for the country's economy. He has even drafted as a party a motion in parliament, a bill actually in parliament, on debt restructuring and debt management authority that is being fronted by, by, by Honorable Bunyasi. So our meetings will continue and we are approaching Reila formally. Once Reila agrees, we will have finished all those stories. Akina Kalonzo have agreed. Mweshimo uh, Moses Masika Wetangula from Bungoma has announced he's going to support Musalia for presidency. Good. So, Luya, we are solid and we are focused on the bigger seat, bigger seat. And very soon, from all these constituencies in Western, we are going to host delegation, delegation from Lugari to Mululu, to Musalia's residence, to give him support that uh, we are supporting you for pre presidency. Yes. From Wisero, another delegation to Musalia's Mululu home. home. We are consolidating the lawyers and the working arrangement we have is that Musalia will go outside Western. Savula, uh, Mweshimo Wetangula will remain in Western to ensure that we are campaigning for Musalia Muda. Lakinio Siri ni mawatangazia sin Muzuri. Uhuru wa makubali ku support Musa? Musalia. Hiyo ndi tunataka. Halavu Uhuru wa metuambia tubombeleze Reila, Reila Akuba? Akubali. Kwa sababu hii Kenya, watu watatu naweza kuwa rais. Yeah. Jirani hapa William Samoe Ruto, wapili, Musalia Mudavadi, na wamwisho re? Lakini wikiwa na timu na Reila na Musalia na Uhuru, si tutambia tu jirani, wewe kuja, wewe tukupatia tu Prime Minister. We are ready to offer Ruto Prime Minister, kaya kidogo hapa. Sawa sawa? Na hii uongozi hiche wapi? Western. Sawa sawa? Ndiyo tuone vile mabarabara zetu tutatengenezo vizuri, tuone hawa mama vile watafadhiliwa vizuri. Mama mama mkienda sentro muneza shangao. Unajua nyi mnatembea tu lugari hapa? Eh? Unatoka hapa Makitarbo, unaenda hapa Mwamba, unakuja kwa Leila hapo kunywa chai, alafu narudi kwa wazee umetembea Kenya. Enda huko nje uangalie vile maneno hii. Iko. Sawa sawa? So, so tumekubaliana we have a deal with Uhuru. And it's sealed. Now we are going to have another deal with Re. Leila. Now we just ask Mheshimiwa Uhuru Ruto, please. Kiongozi mkubwa wako ni mkubwa wako. Mheshimu tu Mwona kule vile Catholic mafanya misa pale. <laughs> hey, hui padri anaongea, anaongea, alafu anakaribisha nani? Bishop. Lakini kama mutanza kutuka nana, mutendeleza sisi wapi? Common Mwona Inji does not understand the content. So it, it's high time that uh, 
the government ensures that each and every individual has an access to that document so that it can make an informed judgment. Secondly, the government is in the red. Kenya government has no money. CDF in all constituencies since July last year, we have only received 9 million. Lugari 9 million, Malava 9 million, Tarbo here 9 million. You don't know what to do with 9 million. Will you pay bursary? Will you start a school project? Or what will you do with 9 million? What we are urging the government, increase the level of disbursement so that we can sort out the issue of fee. Then now you can disburse more money so that you can embark on the projects. 9 million is a drop in the ocean. We cannot do anything with 9 million.